it is just too hard right now to repair our own devices. And when we went home after short session 2020, we went home, but we actually didn't stop working. You know, uh, so many smart people had to get together to figure out how to close the digital divide. What that means is having fast, affordable internet. It means literacy skills to navigate your working devices and having those appropriate devices. Where we failed is that our children went home to have remote learning immediately overnight. We did not have the number of devices for our children to be able to learn every day. We all know that we had warehouses full of laptops and devices that we could not repair to get out to our communities immediately. And the ones that suffered the most were those in our rural communities, those with low income and could not just go to the store and purchase their own. That is why I'm so thankful for the good gentleman from the 7th who was willing to actually step up and um, support this legislation. You've heard the, the debate today. This is not an easy topic. But what I can tell you is that this is one of the most vetted policies of my entire career. Every single word here has been agreed upon, not only by our repair, repair experts, environmental advocates, the FTC, but also Microsoft. Microsoft has come in supportive of this, this bill today. You know, we, we believe that small businesses deserve the tools and the supplies uh, in order to repair their devices. We've had a very vigorous debate today about intellectual property, trade secrets, and sensitive data. But we know that countries are already practicing this. And that's why we need to keep these devices in working order longer. Because we know that as a country, we have a responsibility. We are the second in the nation when it comes to millions of tons, almost 12 million tons that we put into the landfill every year. And in Washington state, we're at 286 tons per year here. And most of that are electronic devices. We can do better. So I hope that you'll please join me today in working to improve the situation for us and so many other states. This is not just about profits. This is about people. This is a people issue. And for the sake of our children, I urge you to please support this bill. Thank you.